Pakistan is hell bent upon sending terrorists over here in the state of Jammu and Kashmir. Pakistan has time and again been told and cautioned not to do this, but it is bent upon doing this and it is not going to stop. Pakistan does not want peace to be made and peace to be regained in Jammu and Kashmir. Some local involvement also in this, which is required to be cut off by the Jammu Kashmir police. Pakistan is hell bent upon sending terrorists over here in the state of Jammu and Kashmir and this has been verified by our intelligence sources also that there are nearly around 300 uh, terrorists in the launch pads around the international border and the Pakistan occupied uh, uh, line of control. Pakistan has time and again been told and cautioned not to do this but it is bent upon doing this and it is not going to stop because it has to divert the attention of its own people from the internal problems that they are having where they are having no food they are having no water, they, they are having no petroleum products, they have, their economy is totally in gold drums. And to divert that attention, it will keep doing this. India has to take strict actions against this. Very good, I would say, the, our people at the, the, at the border who use their surveillance devices and shot down all these four terrorists. And one of them or two who died, their bodies were dragged back into the uh, Pakistan territory. This shows that... Pakistan does not want peace to be made and peace to be regained in Jammu and Kashmir. And India must now take this up at the highest levels in all over the world forums. Otherwise, Pakistan will not stop. Very unfortunate incident that happened that where four of our Jawans were martyred at the spot and then we have heard that one or two also who were injured have been martyred. The uh, problem over here is that uh, these terrorists who are operating here, they were earlier operating in the Kashmir Valley and now since Kashmir Valley has been sanitized pro properly, the people have stood up against all this and the moment any ter terrorist enters any house or any place and all, he is informed, the police is informed and they take action accordingly. Now these terrorists have shifted to this side of the Pir Panchal and this side of Pir Panchal, Rajori Punch area, you know, the ter terrain is such that it is very easy for these people to uh, get into the hideouts because it's shrubbery, very uh, dense forest and also natural hideouts over there. Even in the last encounter that we have seen, the hideouts were stocked completely with foodstuffs, uh, clothing and everything and apart from arms and ammunition. So this shows there is some local involvement also in this which is required to be cut off by the Jammu Kashmir police and they should do this immediately so that no local support is given to these people and then these people will have to come down themselves like what happened in Kashmir Valley. They came, uh, they would come down to buy their foodstuff and moment they would do it, uh, police was informed. So this has to be carry on on one hand and the, on the other hand our, our combing operations are going on and I am very confident that soon we will find that most these terrorists and apart from them the others who are operating here will also be killed and this area will also be sanitized.